So what is an Article 4 direction as far as HMOs are concerned? Well, with permitted development rights, typically when it's in place and Article 4 isn't in place, you're allowed to convert your property from a C3 residential dwelling to a C4 small HMO for up to six tenants, no problems at all with your permitted development rights. Our Article 4 direction removes this permitted development right, which means that should it be, for example, you're looking to buy a new property in England and your strategy is to convert the property, renovate it and convert it into a, from a C3 to a C4, you will need to apply for planning permission to make sure that you are actually legally doing that renovation and using that property as a HMO.